I went right into NOLA, written in 1912 or 1914 by Felix Hart, in honor of his wife, NOLA. Not Lola, NOLA. And that was before New Orleans, Louisiana became nicknamed NOLA. Now, I wrote a very difficult introduction to this NOLA. But I figured if I played it, it would be like old Tom is showing off. But I'm going to do it anyway, okay? On this Steinway and Sons Model B brand. You ready? <clears throat> oh. I don't, I don't believe in showing off. I believe in using what God gave you for the God-given instrument of Steinway. That's got to be the official piano of heaven. We know it's not Yamaha. Oh, gosh. That's all I have to say about that. When such gifts are matched with musical intelligence and a fortunate physical endowment and capped with many years of hard labor, there may emerge a musician of some stature. And such rare persons enter a very special world with its own peculiar problems, difficulties, rewards, and professional preoccupations.